In this segment, we're talking about simple application equipment. Uh, a lot of hand sprayers and a lot of equipment that you use, you have to know how much chemical to mix in a gallon and then try to distribute the mixture over a certain number of square feet. Um, these particular uh, self-metering sprayers uh, are made in such a way that they don't mix unless you're spraying and they don't mix any more than it takes to spray the area that you cover. So when you get through covering the area, you've applied the correct amount of chemical provided you have the rate on the nozzle set. Um, these, the, the, the application rate is adjustable from tablespoons to teaspoons per gallon of water that passes through. You hook this thing to the end of your garden hose so you don't have to worry about uh, pumping the thing up and make sure you maintain pressure or having a battery or anything like that. This thing is, runs off the water pressure in your water system. It also has a non-siphoning uh, aspect to it so that if you lay it, lay it down or the water pressure goes away or the hose breaks or something like that, there's no siphon action that occurs that sucks some of the uh, pesticide considerably back into your garden hose. Um, it also, they also cover a long, uh, uh, a large area uh, for each load because you can put the concentrate in there and it mixes it according to the high number of gallon, how many numbers, how many gallons you spray. Um, also, um, the, uh, uh, the chemicals that you put in will be non-diluted so that when you get through, you can put them back in the original container, rinse it out, and it'll be ready to use the next time. 